All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. We're gonna be starting my Assassin's Creed series playthrough, series of playthroughs. Um, and I'm gonna go in chronological order for this because there's so many of these and I have no idea where the story is taking place. And it seems like the very first Assassin's Creed game would be Odyssey. Get through the shitty games first. That's where we can get to the good ones. Uh, but everything should be good to go. Native resolution. Refresh rate. Graphics. I have all of these on ultra high. I don't know if I'll be able to run this on ultra high. I'll try and see. If not, I'll have to dumb down the graphics once we get into the full game here. Whenever uh, I'm recording on OBS. So if you are new, be sure to leave a like. Enjoy the content. And we will be starting a brand new game. We don't talk during cutscenes. So you guys know that. Uh, also. To let you guys know. They have 100 levels in this game. 100 levels. Uh, I will not be going through this game uh, willy-nilly without getting some XP multipliers when I'm doing some side missions. So you be expecting me to be uh, level 100. And we're going to get through this game as quick as we can. Last time I played this was April 7th. 2022 so brand new game let's start it up we will also do the dlcs even though i don't really like the mytho mythological bullshit that they've done recently but yeah enjoy we are ready my king Tell me, Venekis, have you ever gone fishing with your son? No, never. A soldier's life is all I've had the honor to know. Hmm. I would have liked to have gone fishing with my son. But now... <clears throat> Let us meet our fate, shall we? Spartans! Every breath that you have taken has led you to this moment. Every drop of blood, sweat, and tear, all of it has led to where you stand right now. The Persians come to make slaves of us all. I have a better idea. I say we drench the gods with their blood! What say you, Spartans? For our sons! For our daughters! For Sparta! Not gonna lie, that's a beast intro. I will give him that. Uh, we'll, we'll see how the game runs here on ultra high settings. <laughs> if I run below 60 frames or whatnot. All cutscenes are 30 frames per second, it seems. That was weird. about 55 frames all right let's go into the graphics here 
do very high instead. I'll have to restart the game. Actually, let's keep running it. We'll see how it runs. It'll be okay. I have forgotten how to play. That's for sure. I'm running around like 60. What the hell? If we're running 60, that's completely fine to me. There we go. I don't think there's a uh, difficulty on this game. There might be, I don't know. That's good. I highly doubt it though. Kick you right in your face, son. Uh, definitely not a fan of this game. With all the RPG elements that they went completely overboard with. That's for sure. And it's not even an Assassin's Creed game to me. I mean, damn, bro. Oh. This guy out in. Okay. Beastin. That's all I do. With my gigantic spear. Get this shit. Today, Spartan. I'll oh, get oh. drunk on your blood as the crows feed on your eyes. You will try and you will fail. Oh shit. Uh, is the king of kings. Frame spike. All will bow before him after I crush you. Come, fool. Enough talk. Time to die. There we go. Ooh, nice. Damn. No match for a Spartan. Talk that shit, son. We are betrayed, my king. Jerxes knows of the path behind the mountain. They are coming. <laughs> By dawn, we will be completely surrounded. We are Spartans. When are we not? Spartans. That word will mean nothing. When Xerxes wipes your bloodline from the face of it. Today was a day the Persians will never forget. Tomorrow is a day the world will remember. Finally. Wow, this is big, Layla. Did you really think it's the spear? This is the one. 
The book was almost right on top of it. I've never been so lucky in my life. Okay, let's start her up. Are you sure we can trust this thing? I mean, the book could be... Just start it, Victoria. You're the boss, boss. I'll prep it for you. Okay, so worth noting, I've made some changes since you were last in here. <laughs> There's no keeping up with the tech industry these days. I can crank up the simulation to maximum sensory synchronization if you're up for it. All right, so here we go. Use our difficulty. Uh, nightmare. Hard, normal, easy. Hmm. It's tough. We'll do nightmare. Fuck it. Full speed ahead. I want to see everything this baby's got. Go big or go home. That's what I always say. Let me know if it's too intense for you. I can always change the settings later. This bit will let me know how much information will be fed to you during your time in the Animus. Guided in exploration mode. Obviously guided. I don't want to pull around with ex exploration. Give me as much information as you got. There's no way I'm going in there without some guidance. Glad to help. You can always change your mind later. Listen, Layla, before you go off, if this book is right, this fear, this story, it will change everything. You're putting a lot of faith in a fairly unreliable source. Historian or not, this guy wrote about magical objects and the will of the gods. He's not Homer. Irodotos was the first recorded historian, so there's a lot more truth in that text than you think. I mean, what better way is there of finding Isu artifacts than by trusting in the guy who claimed to meet an actual descendant? I know, but... I need you to trust me. You could be right. This spear, this book, it could all be crap. But something tells me it isn't, and I'm certainly not going to let Abstergo find out first. You're right. We haven't got much to lose anyway. There's just one small problem. What is it? This manuscript is in rough condition, to say the least. The DNA found on the spear has identified two different individuals. You're going to have to pick which strand of DNA to pursue. The choice is yours. All right, so obviously Alexios and Cassandra. Canic in the canon... Universe, I guess. Canon. Cassandra is the main uh, protagonist. Alexios is the antagonist. So, and plus, Cassandra has a better voice actor. Alexios's voice actor is Dog Water. So we're going with Cassandra. She'll help us find what we're looking for. I have a good feeling about this. All right, boss. We're finally good to go. 431 BCE. Here we come. The start of Peloponnesian War. Good luck in there. No pressure or anything, but we're all depending on you. Abstergo isn't going to win this time. If what the book says is true and we do actually find the artifact, the assassins will finally have a chance to rise again. You can do it. Oh, and Victoria, read the book. It holds the secrets I won't be able to find on my own when I'm in there. Aye, aye, Captain. The main story is so dog shit since uh, Desmond... Not gonna lie. <laughs> it is completely poo poo. Uh, but I'll probably do like 30 minutes of the first episode. It is kind of late. Uh, so probably when I get home tomorrow, we will play some more of this. So. <sighs> I'm gonna try to get through this game as quick as I can. I'm not going to do like all the side quests, just the main ones to get through the game and get us to where we need to uh, be a certain part of the story. I'm going to try to get the best weapons or anything, but once we finish this, we will do the DLCs because I think those are directly right after this, and I know it's part of the story. Even though I don't really like the mythical aspect of the game. So. Yeah. If you guys are new, be sure to leave a like. Subscribe. And uh, hope you enjoy.
Big face! Get down here! Cyclops got a message for you. Tell your boss he can stick it. That's for last week! Malaka! The Cyclops is like yeah. to act tough. So act tough! Get the Damn. Shot, and I will. You should know by now. The Cyclops always collects his debts. Okay. You have a lesson to learn. If the Cyclops wants to teach me, tell him to come here himself. Never mess with the Cyclops. Damn. It's like that. Our first victim. Our first victim. Last week. This shit happens every week. I can't keep doing this. Nah. Thanks for the warning. Oh. What happened to you? It's nothing, Phoebe. All taken care of now. The Cyclops again, huh? Hasn't he learned his lesson yet? Apparently not. Of course. Help yourself. You hungry too, Icarus? <laughs> Do you think Zeus would bless me with an ego like he blessed you, Cassandra? Maybe you could ask him for me. I'll try to put in a good word for you. Finally. So, what are you doing here? Oh, I almost forgot. Marcos is looking for you. Uh, what does that weasel want now? Don't know. He wants you to meet him at his new house. On his vineyard. What? A vineyard? Malaka. It's on the road to Sami. He says wine will make him rich. Since when has he had a vineyard? Yesterday, I think. So, Marcos, who owes me drachmi, is buying vineyards. With what money? I don't know. Well, I guess I owe Marcos a little visit. Thank you, Phoebe. <coughs> I'll go tell Marcos you're coming. Go, go! My head. Choices. The choices you make will have impacts both seen and unseen. Consider your options carefully. Okay. We're killing these pricks. You made a mistake coming here. And that's how you do that. I'll have to go up top to get dressed. Well, obviously we got all these uh, side shits, so obviously you guys can see. Let's get this on. Huh. Abilities. Yeah, we know all about that shit, bro. Trust me, next time I record this, you guys will be seeing me level 100 with a bunch of shit. <laughs> so, because I'm not wasting my time or wasting my breath on any of that shit. So, just so y'all know. Okay. But yeah, uh, let me know what your 
favorite Assassin's Creed game is. I would say mine is still Assassin's Creed 2. Even though it came out in 2009, it's still the best Assassin's Creed game to date. And I don't care what the fuck y'all say. It's still the best game. Now, there's a couple games that are a very, very, very close second. There you are. Let's see what you've gotten yourself into this time, Marcos. But I still think Assassin's Creed 2 is the best one. But there's plenty of games that I would have over as my number two each day of the week. One day it could be Black Flag. Another day it can be fucking Brotherhood. I mean, you never know. But maybe when I go through these again, uh, it might change. Which one might do a ranking? I keep telling you, you, you can't do that. Why? It's my farm. I can plant what I want. The grapes will die here. All of them. You have to forget what you know about the past, my friend. Together, we will revolutionize winemaking. Believe me, you will look back on this day and... Cassandra, thank the gods. Phoebe found you in time. About grapes? I can still hear you. I was worried sick. The Cyclops sent his scum to find you. I think they mean you harm. I wish you would have told me that before they hit me. But that's beside the point. You bought a vineyard, Marcos? A vineyard? Why not? I like wine, you like wine, everybody likes wine. Everybody buys wine. Why not from me? Because you don't know how to grow grapes or make wine? I'm a fast learner. You grow grapes on the vine, then you get some wine. <laughs> is that simple, is it? You know me better than to think I don't have a plan. Marcos always has a plan. All right. Then do you have the money you owe me? Do I have the money I owe you? Uh, of course, of course. Well, no, not at the moment. Then get it. Instantly, my friend, instantly. But uh, maybe you should do that. There is a merchant in Sami. I'm not very good at these things, as you know. You want me to collect my own debt? It's just waiting for you and Sami, my friend. Who's the merchant? Luris. You know Luris. He's very nice. Luris? How stupid can you get? Stop giving him money. He always pays me back. After I threaten him. Exactly. Everybody benefits. Luris gets his money, I get my interest, and you have work. Kefalonia is wonderful, is it not? He'd better have my money, Marcos. I'd hate to have to sell our vineyard. Of course he will. Oh, after there's another matter I want to discuss with you. After. Fine, but I'm taking a horse. It's too hot and too long a walk to go on foot. But... Think of it as interest, Marcos. Everybody benefits. Of course, my friend. You shall have your pick. Tell me about this one. The Skiros. You have an eye for sturdy stock, my friend. That horse can cling to mountain passes like a goat. The one in the middle. Tell me about it. Ah, you have picked a beauty, my friend. That horse is from the Salonia, bred for its courage. Huh. I like the look of the one on the right. Ah, the Macedonian. These are bred for battle. A true warrior's horse. I've made my choice. Which one will it be? I'll take the one in the middle. Uh, a, a fine choice, but this particular breed has a few quirks that you might not be aware of. I wouldn't want you to take an unworthy horse. This is the one I want. Are you sure? Because... I'm sure, Marcos. Everybody benefits, especially you. You've chosen the great Phobos. He's never let me down. 
Phobos. Remember, meet me at the temple in Sami when you have uh, your money from Duris. Ah, F therapy. There's plenty of wine left to buy. Don't fret. Not now, you fool. phoebe has been taken. By who? Thugs of the Cyclops. Who else? Snatched her right off the main road. Tell me where they went. In the direction of Itimena Beach. The beach? Can she swim? I'll get her. Yes, go. But don't forget about dear Duris, Cassandra. Marcos, you're a fucking weasel, dude. I don't like his voice. At all. I would kill him if I could. I would definitely kill him, but... That's, uh, not what we're gonna do today, unfortunately. But yeah. I think the next game after this will be Origins, which I have not completed before, but it's actually pretty good. I'll sneak up on them, I like it. Still an RPG game, or RPG Assassin's Creed, but not over the top. Shut it, or I'll tighten those ropes. She'll make good ransom Drachmi for the Cyclops. No one's gonna buy me from you. They're all poor. Quiet, Phoebe. <laughs> oh. Action. This tall grass will keep me hidden. And what's crazy is this game doesn't even have a fucking hidden blade, man. Can't let the rest of those malakas get away. That's what I don't like. Maybe I'm just too fucking old school, and I ask for the most simplest things. Thankfully, Mirage has a damn hidden blade. Loot him. Put this away. That Marcos is going to be next. Shut up. Time to get Easy. Easy out of here. Cassandra, I'm here. Untie me. What is wrong with you? Are you all right? It wasn't so bad. Last time they put a cloth in my mouth so I'd stop biting. Phoebe, just be careful. You're alone now since since my parents died. I'm okay. I've got you and You've got me and Marcos. We're your family, right? <coughs> You'll have to be stronger than that. Don't give in! Let him have it! Got you. <laughs> Again, up. Yes, Pater. Spartan rises as soon as they have fallen. Hmm. Ready or stop? Widen your stance. A soldier. Grounds themselves. Hmm? Good. Good. Uh. Approach me. Ah! That's enough, Nikolaus. The sun's going down. Time to eat, don't you think? <laughs> what are we eating tonight? Tonight we are having baby Alexios. <laughs> and what a feast he will be. No! Him, take me instead. I'm tasty. Yes, yes, you're all sweet as honey. Now, come inside. The lamb's turning black. Here. Lay him in his bed. Yes, Pater. Cassandra. You are my greatest pride. Remember that. You will bring this family 
to glory. Go. Right. You worry too much. <laughs> You don't worry enough. We'll be alright if we watch out for each other. Which reminds me, the thug said you should watch your back. What they say? They said the Cyclops put a big bounty on you. Talos the Stonefist wants you dead. Talos the mercenary? Am I ever not in trouble? Better get him before he gets you. I hear he's really mean. I'll find my way back to town. Here! I lost the stone fist. That's just what I need today. Another broken nose. I'm going to have to take care of that. We're hunted. Why are we not? <laughs> so we're in the tier 9 of mercenaries, apparently. Apparently there's... Different tiers? Well, that's interesting. How do you call for your horse? Uh, can't be in a restricted area. That's stupid. Alright. Yeah. I feel like that they have this in the game though, where you just go to your objective. So that's nice. We're not gonna kill Doris. We'll probably just break a few of his things. Make sure uh, he pays. The smell here. Where's Doris? Where you at? Doris will be at his shop. Yes, yes. That's a big ass dog. Hello, Luis. Business looks good. Tell Marcos to come down here himself if he wants his money. Huh? No, but I'm here now. Look, I was a little late paying. Now Marco says I owe him double because of interest. I don't have it to spare. You should have thought of that when you borrowed Drachmi, Luis. But my family... It's hot. I'm in a bad mood. And you are going to pay. We both know it. Now the question is, what do I break first? You? Or your merchandise? You told Marcos I've paid enough already. I won't bow to 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 a mercenary or to someone foolish enough to borrow money from the Cyclops. From the Cyclops? That's how he bought his vineyard? Look, I know you'd be dead without Marcos. What with him taking you off the street as a kid. But you know what he's doing is crazy. Malaka. Still, that doesn't change the drachmi you owe. Face it. Once the Cyclops gets hold of you, you'll both be dead. Cassandra, good to see you. <laughs> hey, stop! That's my stuff! All right, all right. I'll pay you, just stop. Fine. The man is yours. Just leave. Pleasure doing business with you, Luis. Keep my name off your lips. I don't want the Cyclops coming after me for the debt you can't pay. A hundred. Drock me. Are you kidding me? And now this dude borrowed money from the Cyclops like a damn fool. 
No wonder people are after me. You're running out of time until the Cyclops comes for you, Malaka. He wants his money. Could I have an extension? When he sails back to Kefalonia, he'll come and break you as soon as he docks, if you don't get it. Now, let's be civil. You can't hide behind your glories, Mistios forever, Marcos. He'll kill you, the mercenary, and that little runt girl that hangs around. Of course, not a problem. I'll get the drachmi. Good, or I'll come and watch the Cyclops feed you to his goats. Ah, Cassandra, I can tell from the smile on your face, Duris has paid you your drachmi. Who's smiling? I just heard where you got the drachmi for the vineyard. Are you out of your fucking mind? We can get the money back, can't we? I'm sure it's possible. It will take a lot of work. And even then, I'm not sure. We have no option but to try. Then you'd better be willing to help. I won't do all the dirty work. <sighs> I long for the old days. Remember them? They were simple. You had nothing, young and alone, and I had everything. And I gave you the world, Kefalonia, in the palm of your hand. Cassandra! Uh, Alexios! Don't see fishes like you every day, huh? <laughs> oh! Ha! You hungry? How about we make a deal? I do something for you. You do a few things for me. Everybody wins. Best offer you're gonna get. Huh? Think about it. Valonia. <laughs> Some gift. You were nothing without Marcos. And look how far we've come. From an orphan on the streets to a Mistios with a Havel. And now the Cyclops will take everything away. I can't protect you from him forever. He'll kill me too. Oh, don't be scared of him. And look at you. How could I go up against him? With what weapons? A rusty spear? A broken bow? There you are. Skulking around the temple won't save you from me, Marcos. Drusilla! I was just talking about you. You were? I need that wood, Marcos. These new bows will be the talk of the island. I can't make anything with those bandit malakes stopping the wood shipments. Of course you can't. Why, I was just filling my friend Cassandra in on the details. She already has a plan to deal with these bandits. You know me. Always prepared. What did I tell you? She will leave no stone unturned. I don't care who does it, but someone better got those bandits. Today. A wonderful idea. I, for one, uh, need to rush home. Cassandra, I've cooked up a plan for our Cyclops dilemma. See me when you have time. If you want your wood, you'll have to fix my broken bow first. Hmm. 
I usually only pay when the deed is done, but shit's moving at a snail's pace. Follow me. These balls will make me rich as Chrysos. They're that good, are they? War's brewing. The Athenians need good bows if they want to hold off the Spartans. Everybody benefits, I guess. Who are you? Marcos? You should be tired of this small-time shit. You'd make a fortune in this war. Plus, I hear you're a secret Spartan. That was a long time ago. I'm a Kefalonian. Oh. Hand it over. There you go, good as new. That bow is as strong as Heracles himself. Give it a try. Shoot your arrow at those dummies. Nice. In the ability menu, we got one ability. Hmm. Harder kick. Shadow assassin. Sweet. All right. I'm gonna go ahead and stop here, guys. If you have not done so already, be sure to leave a like on the video. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. As always, hit the notification bell. Follow me on Twitter and everything else. I'll be back with some more Assassin's Creed Odyssey very, very soon. Also, check out my GTA 5 playthrough. We've been playing that over on the PC with some pretty cool mods. So we're playing that alongside with this, and I might start up another game as well. So we have both of these going at the same time, along with probably a retro game. So, yeah, with that being said, I'm out of here, guys. Take care of yourselves, and I'll see you guys on the next one.